Today I'm in Delray Beach with the strongest adaptive CrossFit champion in the world. And we'll be competing in 10 extreme strength challenges to find out who is stronger. Rope race. I was halfway up and I could already see out of the corner of my eye that he made it to the top. What? No way, bro. You're literally like a ninja. Boy. One challenge equals 10 points. First to 60 wins. I'm already winning 10. Zero. Well, I'm gonna come back. What's up, guys? I'm Xavier Rosa. I'm 31, and I flew all the way from Spain to Bali against the shark. Xavier said he thinks he can beat me in a fitness challenge after I gained a little bit of LBS. Chick fil A's gas. Who can pull the car the fastest? Three, two, one, go! All right, this car weighs thousands of pounds. Xavier took on the challenge first, pulling a car that weighs over 4,000 pounds, which is over 20 times our body weight. Oh my gosh, I know this car weighs like 3,000 pounds or more. Three, two, one, go! It was my turn. I started giving it my all, but honestly, it took a little bit longer to get the car rolling than when he went. I did a 180 twist to switch up my technique, but quite honestly, that didn't really help the car move any faster. Whoa. I got 10 on the board. I think the car was in park when I was pulling. Every time I'm facing a workout, I know it's the hardest thing that I face and it never gets easier. Who can handstand walk the fastest? I train this all the time at my gym. I'm a pro with my hands. I might have packed a couple, but you know, I did cheerleading for over 10 years, so my heart's gonna show up today. I was nervous, but I have to win. Even though this is more of a CrossFit challenge, I do handstands all the time in gymnastics, so I think I'll get a pretty fast time. Oh! I don't know why I slowed down so much at the ending. My hands got caught up. The pounds were going back that way. I don't know about that round. Jack's time was 6.93. That's it? And he was a gymnast? Come on. Bro, I was a cheerleader, not a gymnast. Three, two, one. Not only is this challenge more difficult for Xavier, but I practice handstands all the time. And he still beat me, which just shows how strong he is. It's actually 4.41. What? Bro, you beat my time? Yo, literally, I'm getting worse at handstands by the day. I remember that I took a step forward one day and then another step and another step and we got to where we are now and I keep reminding that kid that he's capable, no this Who can bench the highest weight? Level one, 135 pounds. This is my warm-up weight. You only need to do one rep to pass the level. I've been benching since I was 15 years old and not doing anything else. Like I literally never had legs. All right, let's do this. Here we go. And let's go. Ah, bro. That was so easy. Level two, 185. Still warming up. Still warming up with this much weight? Bro, how are you about to do that? All right, let's see it. Okay, two, three. You only had to do one. While Xavier did extra reps for fun, I'm only gonna do one so I can save my energy to win this challenge. Cause honestly, I don't want the consequence at the end. <laughs> that is my pterodactyl screech. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe. Each level is getting increasingly heavier, but I'm pretty confident because I bench almost every day. I'm not doing three cause I'm using a strategy. If I use all my energy now, I won't have more for when the weight gets higher. Level three, 225. This is getting kind of heavy. Maybe for you, not for us. Here we go. Bro, two reps? Two reps? Are you trying to rub it in my face? I don't know. I heard he's really strong. Let's see. All right. I'm not holding back anymore. Level three is getting super intense. Ready? Ah, here we go. Ooh. Smooth like butter. All right. Jack thinks he's super strong, but today we're gonna play a prank on him. All right, it's time for the next level. All right, let's put him no, on. No, no, no. Don't what? get tired, don't get tired. I got you, I got you. All right, you're trying to help me save some energy. That's fine. All right, you're gonna waste all your energy before this next level. I love facing new challenges. I love failing because how I approach it is every time I fail is that I'm one rep closer to achieving it because I have no doubt that I'll get it. One rep closer, one rep closer, one day closer. So that's how I get motivated because I get excited with failure. It's like, 
This was in the one, but next one. This was in the one, but next one. For some reason, they decided to add twice as much weight on there than the level before, which makes absolutely no sense. Plus, I've never even done that much weight before, but Xavier said he's done it. Level 4, 495. This cannot even be real. How did you just add 345 plates? I literally got water and came back, and now they doubled the weight? Dude, are you seriously gonna do this? I can. Can you? Come on. Uh, if you do it, then I'll try. Let's go. The easiest 495 you've ever seen. I've never <laughs> seen anyone bench this much weight in person. You want You want me to help you lift it? I've got this. Watch. That's so much weight. I, I, I don't feel like... Uh, watch. You don't... Uh, what? Bro! Oh my gosh! Holy crap! Yo, that is literally the heaviest bench press I've ever seen anybody do in person. Really? Dude, that was insane. You go now. Bro, I did say if he did it, I'd have to do it. I need the good luck dog. Now that I got the men in black dog, I should have men in black power. Let's do this in. This will be a new record for me by 280 pounds. Ready? I really, Are you sure? Yeah, I need a you, spot. All right. Ready? How did I? Dude, I never. You got this. I never bet how much weight. Good job, good job. Wait. Bro, what? That's styrofoam? Are you kidding me? When I competed against other adaptive athletes, I had to uh, adapt everything because uh, my goals weren't the same and I kind of hated that. Had to take a little more time to do my things or to make all the setups for the workout. But I didn't like that. I didn't want to be treated like special, like someone special. I just wanted to be like everyone else. All right, let's do this. Wow. Okay. What happened to the 345 plates that you added? Level four, 315 pounds. Whoa, that's like two of you. You're gonna go first? Let's just make sure these aren't crank weights. I've never benched this much weight in my life, by the way. You got it. Come on, hype them up, people, let's go! There's like 10 people watching, I promise. Oh my gosh, I didn't even touch the bar, bro! Holy crap! Let's do this. By the way, this is for my grandma's cat. Xavier was hyping me up, but I've honestly never even done close to this much weight in my life before. Oh, crap! <laughs> oh my god! Mom! Ow! We're good. The score is now 30 to 10. I was born this way. They had to actually amputate my left arm when I was born, my fingers, my legs were also, both of my tendons were messed up. So I was born different. With Xavier in the lead, Jack has 20 points to catch up to Xavier. You're not tired from benching 345 plates. I'm, I'm good. Okay, we'll see. Whoever can do the most pull-ups wins. Most pull-ups, go! One, two, okay, three, Four, he has a steady lift right now. And he's already at six and still going. Seven, this is crazy. Eight, nine, that's right about where I'm gonna give up. You should just give up now. Why are you still going? Bro, slow down. Slow down, slow down. I have to do more than you. If I lose this challenge, I lose. I think he's going easy on me because he's in the lead by a lot. I'm really gonna have to step it up right now. Ready? One. Oh my gosh, I'm already tired. Two. Three. I can do this all day. Four. Hey, can one of y'all go get me Chick fil A while I'm doing this? Six. Let's go. Seven. Come on. Eight. Can you give me a book? This is too boring. Nine. I started going and repping as many pull ups as I could, but honestly, my arms started getting tired a lot quicker than I thought. Fourteen. Oh my gosh, this is so hard. Fifteen. Keep going. Sixteen. Oh my gosh, I gotta get that 180 above the bar. Yeah, just come on. Yeah! I literally gave that all I got. Come on, bro. Let's go. Wow, that was a lot harder than I remember. Jack's trying to catch up. That gives you challenges, especially when you're going up because you just want to be accepted. You just want to be part of the group. Three, two, one, go! <laughs> Let's go! All in the turn of the wrist. The boys are now tied. The only way this is gonna work is if we do one of these and just lean back. Bring me the chicken minis. One chicken mini. All right, I'll take that one right there. All right, ready. Chicken minis, boys! Chicken minis came through that 
extra nugget will be back. It's a victory for the shark, but it's straight on the board of half. Somehow, shark is in the lead. Five power clean and jerk the fastest. You're gonna lose. You know why? I'm totally kidding. I never do these, and this is what he is so good at. All this crossfit. All right, I think we should let you go first. Three, two, one, go. Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh my gosh. Yo! You're only at 10 seconds and you've already done two. What? I don't even know how I'm gonna do that much weight. Oh! You gotta get one more. You're at 24 seconds. Five! Oh! My gosh! You are strong, bro. You are strong. Your time is 27 77. Oh my gosh, 27 seconds? I don't even know if I can lift that much weight for once. You better. Three, two, one, go! Done! Ah! One! Ah! For my grandma's set! Oh, yo, this is so much harder than I thought. Ah, how much time do I have? Ah, ah. Oh, let's go, come on. Ah, and, ah. Oh my gosh. And Jack's time is 31.30. No, oh bro, I literally tried as hard as I could. Almost. That was my technique though. I think you can come to class in time. Uh, what? You should come to class on time, but hey, that's real fun for me. It made me learn that just because I have it harder in some things, it doesn't mean that I'm less or less able, that we decide uh, where we want to go, and that that's where we come from, doesn't determine how far we can go. Most muscle-ups win. All right, you know what? Since you went first for the pull-ups, I'll go first for the muscle-ups, just so I can set the bar high. No pun intended. Watch out. Here we go, and go. Go! Yeah. Oh my gosh! One. That's one. <laughs> That's yeah. Make you. Ah! Uh, ah! Two! Woo! And I can't! I can't! I'm so weak! I literally am not good at muscle ups. After I put on 15 more pounds, it's so much harder to do. What? Oh my gosh! That was some power, bro. Two! Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. You're done there. Oh, three. You don't even have to do more. Four. Yo, he's making this look so easy. Oh, you still pushed though and made it. That was impressive. Oh, you're still going? This is so much harder than it looks. I could only get two. Bro, you can stop now. You already beat All right. Me. Growing up, I didn't have anyone like me, so I couldn't learn from anyone else. But thanks to social media, I had this, this access to other guys and other girls like me who also faced challenges like I did, but got to where I wanted faster so I could learn thanks to social media with their examples. So I could, you know, like, oh, that's how this person does it. And take ideas from them so I can advance faster. So follow me. Most handstand push-ups win. Well, I cannot lose this round because he's already ahead of point and if he wins this, he wins the entire competition. Let's do this. One, touching my head all the way to the ground. Let's go. Oh, this is easy. Oh, wait, it's getting a lot harder. Oh my gosh, I gotta keep going. That's it. That's all I got. Oh my gosh. Literally adding weight makes it so much harder. Whenever you're ready. All right. One, two, three. Whoa, you're going fast. Four. Five, what you don't have to do anymore. Six, chill. Seven, eight. Bro, you are again. How are you still going, yo? Dude, how did you have to rub it in my face like that? You did way more than me. You already won once you hit eight. All right, well, you know what? Congratulations, you just won the challenge. Second place. Second place? That's like a participation medal. And then first. Okay. You know, I do gotta give it up for you. You are a beast. So uh, yeah, I don't have to do that consequence, right? All right, Jack, it's time for your consequence. Consequence? Wait, you gotta get to the airport, right? I have to intercede towards the consequence. What is it? This is your consequence. No! 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 It's so 
cold! Oh my gosh! Subscribe! <laughs>